hello guys in this video i will show you how to import blog post from a wix website into wordpress website now i am going to transfer this website from wix into wordpress if you want to know about the full procedure then you can ask in the comment section and i will create another video on that topic but in this particular video we will focus only on the post that how we can transfer this post directly to wordpress dashboard now there are two methods one is to use a plugin called cms to cms so this is a cms conversion plugin that will convert different types of website into different cms as you can see here if you want to use this, this plugin then you will have to pay for this because this is not a free plugin but in this video we will transfer this post for free and we'll use manual method so to transfer this post first of all you need to log into your wix website so this is the dashboard of my wix website and then just visit your website like this once you are on your website then you will have to write blog dash feed dot xml so you will have to write this blog feed dot xml with your domain name for example your domain.com slash blogfeed.xml if this blogfeed.xml does not work then you can simply write feed.xml or just simply write feed now once you write this then click enter and you will see your rss feeds now we will have to save this xml and then we'll have to import this to our wordpress dashboard so to save this just write just right click and save as and save this as xml file click save and now we have successfully saved this xml file now go back to our wordpress dashboard and go to tools and import and you will see rss so as we have exported our rss feeds then we can use this plugin now click on install now and run importer and now choose file and select the one that we just exported so click this and click open now upload file and import okay let's try again okay let's check the our posts okay if this does not work for you as it is not working here also so go to plugins and click add new and search for xml import now here you can see a number of plugin so we will choose this one import any xml or csv file into wordpress so click on install and now activate this plugin once you install and activate this plugin you will find a new tab here called all import so click on new import now float file and choose blockfeed.xml now here you can choose first pages taxonomies etc but we are going with first so we will so we will choose posts and continue here it says there are 14 items and you can see on the wix website we have 14 posts here so which means that this data is correct and continue to step 3 ok now go to step 4 
यूनिक आइडेंटिफायर और क्लिक ऑटो डिटेक्ट एंड नाउ क्रिएट न्यू पोस्ट फ्रॉम द रिकॉर्ड न्यूली प्रेजेंट एन यूर फाइल अपडेट एग्जिस्टिंग पोस्ट एंड चेंज द डेटा सो नाउ जस्ट लीव दिस ऑप्शन एज डिफॉल्ट एंड क्लिक कंटिन्यू नाउ कंफर्म एंड रन इम्पोर्ट import completed so now let's check our posts so now as you can see we have all the posts imported successfully so these are the posts that appear on our wix website one thing you may not notice but this importer plugin does not import the images by default so now to import images you will have to upgrade this plugin to a pro version or you can use another free plugin called how to import images so just go to your plugins and click add new and this is the plugin that we're going to use for our images so search for auto upload images now this is the plugin and just click on install now and click activate so once you install and activate that plugin then you will have to go to your posts and edit all the posts that contain images now to edit each post this is a very difficult work so just click this select all button click bulk action and click edit now click apply you have edited all the post here now click on update so as you can see 17 posts updated so that is how you can import all the posts from a wix website into a wordpress website and after that you can edit all the posts just to see their images hope this video will help you if you have any question in mind then feel free to ask in the comment section thanks for watching i'll see you in the next